Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Grimwit, and this is Miasmata. I'm here to show you around this game, and also to put Rick Void to sleep. There's the head. And it is, fortunately, on our map. We're going to head north today. Hopefully, we'll actually find the head. Or at least get closer to it. I think we will. Whoop. I'm surprised I didn't get a fever from that. Game-wise, there isn't much to talk about right now. Other than just heading north. We'll explore a new forest. We'll pass by these red cap mushrooms, which we don't really need. And I'm gonna crouch every now and then to make sure no uh, creatures are around. Creature, singular. But first, let's head to the top of this hill. That's a head. That's a head. See if I can add that head to my map. And then just like that, it began to rain. I probably should have mentioned that time passes when you're doing certain things. Ooh, there's something over there to add. And I'll find it eventually. Whenever you're drawing on your map, time passes. I'm not sure how many minutes. Not very many. Maybe 15? Whenever you're doing an examination or research, time passes. Whenever you're creating something, time passes. And I don't mean in the normal rate. It just skips ahead. So one second you'll be drawing on a map, and the next second it'll be raining and thundering. Where'd that head come from? All right, new head. Right about here looks good. That one is absolutely added to our map, and this one will be partially added. I could continue this, but I'd rather continue on north. I want to find another camp by the end of the day so I have a place to rest. When you're playing this game, and I do recommend you play, even if you're just watching me. Mm, I don't need those right now, I don't think. Gray shelf, gray shelf. Were those medicinal? No. There we go. As a mental stimulant, I need to replace it. When you're playing this game, I recommend, if you're worried about the creature, to just stick around grass, or keep grass in mind. He's really not that difficult to deal with. There's been some discussion as to whether he's random, 
or if he shows up on certain parts every time. And as near as I can tell, both of these are correct. Later, I'm sure we'll get a better look at him. Even if I die because of it. You have to wonder how come the savages or whatever the previous citizens of this island called themselves, how come they didn't build tiny little bridges over puddles of water? Hmm. No, not on my map. Let's go ahead and take this clarity tonic. That's right, stick it right into my eyebrow. Hmm. Tastes like chocolate coffee. Taking the Clarity Tonic will instantly put our position on the map. We can't map anything like this, but at least we can know whereabouts we are. Sometimes it's... Well, I, I think it's more useful when you're in an area that you've already mapped, so you can find other landmarks and find your way around. But I'm going to continue using this as it is. Ah, oh, there's the head. We are getting ever so close. Stuck, stuck on a tree. Hello. A cabin. Not in the woods. Hmm. Heads are right there, but that won't help us. We need a second landmark that we already know. Let's see if we can get down to that cabin and check it out. Maybe we'll find a map. Squirrels. I could just burn a medicine and hop off the cliff, but I'd rather do this more safely. Robert Hughes isn't the man he used to be. Well, well, well. This is a cabin with a view. And what a view. Take that, pot. Notes. Simply notes outlining potency enhancers. We already know about that. That one was far more interesting, talking about Chancellor Callus. He now has militant rule over Telluria, or whatever it's called. I keep forgetting its name and messing it up in my head. I have sort of a mental dyslexia. Hmm. We'll figure out what these little pond-shaped mushrooms are. How about now? Oh, before that. Maps to blue cap mushrooms and giant blooms. 
We already have a blue cap. We don't need that. Ah, we've replaced our mental stimulants now. And things are going just dandy. Now let's research this white mushroom. I'm kinda hoping they'll get me high. But no, it's just a basic medicine. plan here is to get close to the head. We know there's a landmark that can be seen from the head off in the distance, and it itself is a landmark that is on our map. That looks shallow enough to walk through. So all we need to do is go out into the ocean far enough to find a landmark we know. Like that head. Yes, that will do nicely. Good. More cartography action. Rich in heart-thumping, adrenaline-pumping mushrooms. It's a pretty mushroom. I wonder what it does. Well, fortunately, we have a lab right here on hand. Hey, squirrel. Hmm. Let's go ahead and add this area before I look up this mushroom. if I can't... I seem to remember something on the horizon that I could add. Well, there it is. Just a faint flicker. Kind of cheating. And I don't think there's another one. So let's head a little bit south before I look up this mushroom. Actually, before we do that... There's a light over at the Frankenstein play. There's a light... I, I should probably not sing. Recently, Japan and my wife have become obsessed with owls. But we know what owls mean in this game. Now, what do you suppose he's looking at now? If you have YouTube on HD right now, you can kind of see in the distance. But we are right there at the circle. 
where the giant blooms should be. I think this is shallow enough to ford. Do we ford the river or go around? Success. Here we are. They said giant blooms, but my god. There's a, they are the size of toilet seats. And now we have two things to research. I've been drinking Godiva cho chocolate coffee this entire time and the, the caffeine is starting to kick in. Soon my brain will start going so fast I'll begin to stutter. Take that, pot. Oh, Thirst, when will you ever stop being annoying? Energy Stimulant Type A Poison Inhibitor Let's see. Here we are. We need something to inhibit type A poison for our endurance emphasis drug. I had to remember. I don't know when this energy stimulant will come in handy next time because we are about to permanently enhance our energy. Using this giant bloom, this blue cap mushroom, and the ability to spontaneously create a syringe. my next trick, I will make this red syringe, which will permanently enhance our endurance, into a blue syringe. Another symptom of the plague resolved. This Bunsen burner is also a save point. I think that's going to do it for this video. On the next video, we'll head further north and see if we can't map out those cliffs. Stay tranquil, everyone. <laughs>